Hi guys! Hey everyone! Welcome to Make2 and another episode of Minecraft on the PC in our Let's Play The Searchers. Last time we went exploring and we said why don't we take all that stuff we found in the mine and try and build something with all those mine rails. So I think you suggested why don't you build a bridge? <laughs> Look at that. So I built a bridge. It's really long and we're going to go take a look and we're going to go and take a ride over to the villagers and say hello and see what they have to say for themselves. So the whole point of doing that was hi, to... Hi Mrs. Pinchy. Oh hi Mrs. Pinchy. The whole point of doing that was to see if maybe having a cart would help you transport more things back and forth from the village but I guess maybe that doesn't really matter. Well by things you mean villager. You wanted me to kidnap <laughs> a villager and somehow install them in our farm and make them work for us like a slave. So I can't yet do that because I literally these are all the rails I have to go from here all the way to the other end. I don't actually have a way of hooking it up to <laughs> <laughs> to somewhere else yet so oh i just assumed you could bring the villager over in the cart and then, then just like, like push yeah, the cart so exactly. well i don't know if it quite works that way <laughs> now anyway this is let's just take a little bit of a look from the side this is pretty big yeah it goes in not all the way down in the water but it looks like it does but they kind of stop one below the surface of the water i'm impressed that you even bothered to make these pylons under the bridge because you, it would have worked just fine if you hadn't right yeah but you know if you're building something you may as well make it look nice we want things to <laughs> look nice in our world uh, it did take a long time, uh, mm. and I'm sure many of you in Minecraft have said, I'm going to build a really big something, a really big wall, a really big house. And then you just think like, oh, this was a difficult thing I've set for myself. Look, you can't even see the end of it. Yeah, It's really big. And making it have enough visual interest is really hard. I saw some amazing bridges online that just look out of this world amazing. This is not one of those, but hopefully it's got a little bit of interest. Now we're going to put the Minecraft down here. We're going to get in the Minecraft. Is it called a Minecraft? Nope, it's called a Minecart. We're going to get in the cart. Mm -hmm. It's slower than <laughs> it's slower than walking, I think. But so much but fun. We're, ha we're having a lot of fun. <laughs> Can I look at this way? Oh, how cute. Just watching the world go by. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Hi, house. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> I have explored powered rails. Oh, we're going, we're going a bit faster. Yeah. Um, powered rails are actually really expensive in gold. I don't have that much gold. We can now see the village. It's coming into sight. Wow, this is exciting. Uh, but powered rails are really expensive, and I don't have enough of them yet. That would mean I wouldn't have to hold down my finger. Because <laughs> if I take... Oh, if I take my hand off... You we're still go for a traveling while. for a little bit, and I think we're slowing down some. Minecraft observes the properties of inertia and in physics. Yeah, unless you have power by weird redstone things. Sure. So, so wait, to have a powered rail would take both gold and redstone, I would assume. Yeah. So normal rails are made of iron, uh -huh. and powered rails are made of gold. So they're really expensive. Oh, you'd so, have to like craft all new rails. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I th I was hoping that I could just add redstone to rails, but the rest is mm -hmm. that. So now this is the fun bit. <laughs> nice. <laughs> so cool. there it is. I should have actually put one more there. Yeah, that's why. I, <laughs> I don't know how I'm going to get back up. Oh but... no! Well, you can take the car. It's fine. We'll oh, get there. Oh gosh. Ooh, let's get. I've actually planted this because when I was building this, I did a little bit of look at this. That's cool. Yeah. Actually, just a little tip before we get onto it. How I built it was I built the top bit just by standing on it, but to build the under bits. Mm -hmm. I actually built an entire second bridge all the way across, just right at this level, at the water level, so that I could pop out and do some of this building underneath. Uh, it was a bit of a pain. I mean, I did see you, like... And then like, I got rid of that second bridge, obviously. Well, I did see you, like, going underwater a few times while you were building. Yeah, so I had to go all the way under, like, this. Yes. To go okay. pop, 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 to put the right blocks in the right places. Right. It's kind of fun. I didn't realize you could hold your breath for so long, but you can. <laughs> A uh, dangerous thing for someone like me who often hurts himself in Minecraft to think is, oh yeah, I can survive underwater. But here we are in the village and we've actually got a whole bunch of stuff with us because, as I was saying, I know at least one of the villagers wants paper. Mm -hmm. So I've got a whole load of sugar cane with me. Ooh, so we don't have many pork chops. Yeah, we don't so, have any pigs on our farm yet. No, and I was going to see if we could find a farmer. Because if we had a farmer, we could then... If we wanted to, steal the farmer, kidnap the farmer, and then take them away with us. Can Let's you tell see. by their outfits what they are before you I talk to them? I think so, yeah. So I think white means librarian. So I, sure. he, if, wait, if I give him paper, 
he gives me one emerald. I've got, this is all the emeralds I have. I've got six already, so I've done pretty well. And if I give him a book and, wow, 15 emeralds, I get Aqua Affinity. Aqua Affinity means I think I can breathe underwater for... Oh, that would have been helpful for building your bridge. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's okay, though. And let's see, anybody in here? No, it's abandoned. They've got dirt in their house. Yeah, and now... dirt again in their house. Huh. It's getting towards nighttime. I'm pretty sure I have a bed in one of these. <laughs> I was going to say you could just squat in one of their houses. But yeah. when they all start going for their inside... They're going to all start going inside soon. Okay. Like now. Like now, yeah. <laughs> so you have to choose, like, who's the best house to squat Well, they in. need a bed, you see. But you didn't bring a bed? Like, you can't no, make a bed No, because I'm pretty sure I slept in here before. Oh. But huh. I think I might go home, because <laughs> otherwise I'm going to get severely squashed. So things can come in to a villager's house. If you don't have no, but I just have on. to spend the whole night here just being bored. Oh, I see. Which, uh, you know. <laughs> sure. So sure, sure. we'll be back in the morning. <laughs> so you just hang tight. That was and a successful first outing. In the blink of an eye, we will be back. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, everyone. <laughs> back at the village. Back at the village after a long night's sleep. Now, we were meeting this librarian. He or she needs a lot of paper. Oh, flame one. So let's craft out. We've got a whole bunch of sugar cane with us. Just mm, butcher. I can't remember what a farmer looks like, but I haven't. Weaponsmith. Weaponsmith. Ooh, what's helpful. he need? 18 coal. Let's give him 18 coal. Get ourselves an emerald. That's cool. And now. Oh, I've already traded with this guy. Oh, look, you can see. You see those. What's that? That means that he's been traded with. And now, because I've given him something, he can now... If I give him seven, seven emeralds, he gives me an iron axe. That okay. is a bad deal, my friend. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Librarian. Okay, let's go... There's a crafting table... No, not in here. There's a whole bunch of crafting tables in this village. These villagers are... Whoa. Mm -hmm. Like... Okay. Yeah, gotten up close and personal. Yeah, with a one. little bit of smoochy smooch. I remember this. Those double furnaces... Okay, here's our crafting table. What do we need? We need a whole bunch of paper. There we go, paper. Okay, we've got a... F what are these dudes doing? Come on, guys. They're having a very intense conversation by the Get door. Get out of my way. They don't they... want you to leave. I'm going to break down if your you wall. you break their huh? window and jump out? Yeah. Ooh. Oh, gosh, you're surrounded. Leather worker. Do you want to have... you? I know you think Mr. Mr. Pinchy is creepy. You don't think... I think they want to rumble. Toodles, guys, toodles. Okay, librarian, let's give you some paper. And let's just see. Oh, this guy can get that. Let's try. Oops. <laughs> what are they doing? Whoa. Oh, my goodness. I think you're really agitating them. I think they remember that you stole from them. Yeah, they're like, we don't want to get... Who's the guy in pink? Which no. one is pink? This the one. The one that just went past. <laughs> I think yes. that's a cleric. Yeah. Okay, got it. Ooh. Yeah, you I got have, plenty of zombie see. flesh. Oh, eight gold. I got a lot of zombie flesh. Now you got nine emeralds, so what can you get from nine emeralds again? Oh, let's see. So now he's got these bubbles. She's got these bubbles around him or her, which means she can now do more trades. So if I give her one emerald, I get oh, two redstone. Oh, one emerald for two lapis lazuli. Is that a good deal? I don't know. <laughs> What are they? They've gone nuts! They really have. <laughs> okay, mate, is this dude going to be a farmer? He's on the farming... No, you're running away. Nope, no, weaponsmith. Weapon they are all out in... Shepherd? Shepherd. Okay, hey, Mr. Shepherd. Hmm. Yeah, so you don't think these dudes are creepy? Uh, they definitely are. Okay. What do you but get? You, you just did, give you me different coloured wool. I don't you want You did steal from them, so... Well, are you saying they weren't creepy before then? Well, they just weren't as agitated as far as I recall. Well, maybe also they've been invaded recently. <laughs> so there's no farmer, which means unless I can find one. Yeah. The only other thing one can do if you steal, kidnap a villager is you can get a couple of villagers and then you can breed the villagers. Mm -hmm. And if you breed the villagers far enough away from this village, mm -hmm. in just the right way, they can make an iron golem. And an iron golem is something that protects the village. You can make one here as well. I just need to add more doors onto this onto this village and they start... Um, How interesting. Start having more villagers. Villagers are dependent on the number of... Uh, what are they called? The number of doors in a village. Huh. <laughs> and if there's enough doors 
like if I put a door here, for instance, and a door over here, then they would start having more villagers. And when there's enough villagers, they will then make an iron golem, or an iron golem may just appear to look after all the villagers. And what does the iron golem look like? Like a big, tall, wide, lumbering man. From one of those. This dude who's in the. Oh, yeah, in black. Weaponsmith. Not in black. It's brown. This one. Mm hmm. Well, we got somebody, he's a weapons man. I'm somebody, colorblind. Yeah, somebody asking us whether you're colorblind in uh -huh. a comment because they notice that you do mix up colors quite a lot. And I was yeah. like, yeah, we talked about I'll it. I try before. hard. But... You do. Okay, well, I think that's about all we can get. We've mm -hmm. got four emeralds. We could obviously do a little bit more trading, but it doesn't look like we can well, find a, sh a village. What we could do, of course, is add to what I'm going to do while we're here. You could just steal from them. Again. Oh, I was just going to say, I'm going to add more doors and see if I can make more villages and maybe one of them. Sure. We'll be a farmer. Exactly, yeah. Okay. We have some wood on us, so let's just get some doors. Let's get six doors. That's enough. And put some doors around and maybe one day soon there's going to be, yeah, a farmer. If nothing else would be cool if there was an iron golem. An iron golem would protect them from me if I attacked a villager. And also from any monster who would come to attack. They're really, really strong. Now, the good thing for me about having an iron golem is you can, if you have tons of patience and resources, make an iron golem farm. And you can make a farm with just villagers. They create iron golems. The iron golems then fall down a hole and die. And when they die, they give up iron. So it's the only way in the game of making iron from nothing. How cool. Villagers create iron golems. Iron golems are made of iron. Yeah. I think that's everything. Was there one over here? This house? I think everything otherwise has a door. So I don't quite remember the equation, unsurprisingly. But there is a way of making sure that you can count how many doors are going to be. This one... Where's the door on this one? Well, let's add a door. Yeah. <laughs> um, let's not ruin your little house too much. Maybe on this side we can put a nice little house. Maybe it's the village jail. <laughs> yeah, let's put one there. Okay, I think that counts. So the sun's about to set and I think we've had enough fun in the village. We've earned a bunch of emeralds, but it's time to head home. But we've got this wonderful bridge. And it could be cool if we just hang out on the bridge and see what happens as night falls, don't you think? <laughs> You're acting like this was your idea. Well, it was your <laughs> idea, and then, like, I don't want to die. But yeah. it is pretty well lit up, so we're just going to see what happens. I think if we hang out this side, all the villagers, we're going to watch them go inside. Uh -huh. And then monsters are going to start. They're all going to go inside because they know monsters can come. Uh -huh. Monsters are going to come. Hopefully, they can't get through doors. So hopefully they won't hurt any of our villagers and turn them into zombie villagers. And mm. then they're probably going to come after us. So they won't not going to spawn on the bridge. Mm -hmm. But they may come and start to fight us on the bridge. Okay. See, I was thinking, what if you just stood right in the right very in the middle. middle of the bridge. And then you could see the monsters approaching from all up and down the bridge no i think i'm but gonna have because to... you've got the torches that's why yeah you yeah. want to make it safe don't you, you can't just have you know... <laughs> i think it would be hilarious <laughs> <laughs> well you gotta have your world but at le least letting you safely travel that's part of the thing when you build any empire you've got to have mm -hmm. good safe fast roads that's what i have done because i don't like getting killed but we're gonna tempt fate and <laughs> <laughs> see what can happen so we're gonna stand here it might be we retreat and when we retreat of course monsters could come from that way so it may well be right in the middle that we are surrounded on all sides i mean if we die you can blame me at but least you could... we're very near home what ha what would happen if you like jumped off the bridge and into the water exactly i was gonna say that is my one do you have a boat on you i don't but you know it's not that far okay. i can just hang out in the water overnight okay. if it gets super bad got it but i think we're gonna be okay so let's just have a little bit of fighting just to, yeah, try and show that I'm not going to get too scared. Ooh. Ooh. It's See, dark, but they're still hanging outside. I know. they yes, going on? They're suddenly going to scurry. Okay. I think, unless it might be because I'm not close enough to them. Oh, no. They're not moving. Oh, okay. oh no, there they go, there they go. Right. I was worried a little bit. There. I was going to say, if we see a zombie attack, the building, that could be cool too. <laughs> well, then I would go and try and protect them, I guess. They're, okay, they're, yeah. they're, they're, they're like, going, they're yeah, going. All right. I mean, the sun... No, it's pretty... It's almost bedtime. Mm -hmm. They're not quite going in, are they? <laughs> I think they may well get attacked because oh, I'm gosh. so close. 
Well, there's that one. That it's one. Just hanging he's out okay. On his deck. Because yeah, no one can get them on the deck. Okay. Got it. Oh, All crumbs. right. It's dark now. Ooh, look how beautiful. And this is pretty. Yeah. We got the sun. We got no. We okay. don't have the moon. <laughs> That's called the moon. Yeah. Yes. The white thing in the sky. God, okay, it's yeah, so you really do have a, now. a really well lit bridge. I don't think I've seen the bridge from your house at night, have I? Well, that that is going to be how mm-hmm. we try and end out the episode. Let's see if any creepies come. We'll fight them off, and then we'll head home and get a look at this beautiful, beautiful lit bridge from the roof. I'm not seeing anything. I think I might be seeing something there. Oh, uh, uh, what do hmm. we think? Hmm. Hmm. I don't think it can see me though. I'm too far away. Right. But I think I could be, it's either a creeper or a cactus. <laughs> <laughs> we should have logged it while it was still daylight. So oh, there's an Enderman. Oh, no, he's coming for you. He's coming for you. No, he could. Oh, oh! God. oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> he made a zippy sound. It was not Don't look nice. at him. Don't look at him. Oh Don't look at him. Wow, dude. No, he could. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> oh. Uh, he could also steal bits of the bridge, oh gosh. you know. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. He's coming uh, up. Oh, I think he looked He's making at... a nasty old noise. Oh, no. Ah. Oh, gosh. I really don't like wow. these dudes. Ah. I've never seen them in action before. I have killed one, as you know. Yes, but not while they were moving around. Are you... If... Oh, he doesn't like being on water. Oh, well. Oh, well, dude. We'll see this. Ah, is... crap. Gosh. Oh, did you see him open his mouth? Yeah. Wow, I never have seen them move like this before. This is so cool. Um, yeah, cool. <laughs> I think he does know. Oh! Nice. Get you, get you. Oh, that oh, was a nasty, nasty noise. noise. Wow. Ooh, that was, uh, <laughs> that was intense. Oh, they are nasty. And wow, you said like in 1.10, isn't it? The newest one. They can now spawn in the nether as well. Oh, Because obviously no. from the end. That's okay. just terrible. Okay, so what do you wow. want to do? Well, <laughs> that was definitely a something else because it's disappeared now. Whatever yeah. was there. Ooh, that was it harsh. looks like we can now see a bit more clearly. Oh, oh, there's a whole bunch of zombies. Uh, yeah. Okay. We can either go after them to protect no, the village. No, no, I think. No. I okay. mean, they're Ooh, not there's gonna... a spider. Oh, see, can the spider crawl on the bridge? Yeah, I think everything else just. I mean, the Enderman obviously could come, but mm-hmm. I think it was a little bit wary because it does not like being on water. But everything else, oh. Everything else is quite happy to be on water. Yeah. See, these dudes They're can gonna see me. They're going to come after you up on the bridge. Come on. These, see, are, these are zombie villagers, I think. No, they're just zombies. But see, you're just kind of waiting for them no, to No, that's a zombie you. village, you can tell by the nose. Yeah. And what do you I, want me to do? I was like, you could go into the middle of the bridge and see if you can see them approaching from, from, uh, from far I don't, away. Oh, they can't see me from that far away. Oh, okay, see. I see, I see. Yeah. Got it, got it. They only Ooh. can see... They've got less good eyesight than I do. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, is there something at the... the... <laughs> oh, gosh. Lots of noise. Lots of noise. The spot... Oh, there he is. Yeah. Oh, that's a baby. Oh. Okay. Couldn't you just adopt the baby zombie and it make it your own? It <laughs> turn up. It will turn into a big zombie. Oh. Can't get He's out of the water. Oh, poor little thing. Oh. Aww. Oh, you don't want creepers to get on your bridge, do you? No, because okay, they might blow it up. bad idea then. Oh, is that the sound of the baby zombie? Or is I think that a so, yeah. Else? Oh my gosh. Well, you know. Ooh, skeletons. Uh-huh, uh-huh. <laughs> I think that's another Enderman there. Okay, don't look at it. You can't see me from this far away. <laughs> the creepers probably can see me if they get any closer. Yeah. So basically, we've just, because we've hung out here, we've mm-hmm. let a whole bunch of monsters spawn in the village. Sure. And then we're going to leave the villagers to it. Yeah. They can, you know. Survival of the fittest. Take care of themselves. I created all these things by me being there and disturbing the world <laughs> but so by now daytime, I'm gonna go home. a lot of them should disappear right? yeah the creepers so. won't the spiders oh. won't <laughs> okay so we might come back to a flaming it may be but normally they'll pop out of existence soon enough mm-hmm. nothing's followed us let's see on well, the other side of the bridge yeah see there's a we can boat. dash towards the house and maybe yeah not have to worry about things spawning yeah but it's been i think you know those few times we have died i think we've died right out or we did die right out. oh there's a zombie we did die right out in the open once mm-hmm. when we were very just starting off and we had virtually nothing but now we've got some cool armor yep and we're a bit more practiced and seasoned at fighting things mm-hmm 
And oh, actually, I can go in this way. See, I thought that you put up so many torches around here that things shouldn't be spawning around your homestead. Yeah, they shouldn't. I haven't put torches literally everywhere. Okay. So now we're safe in our own little world. So let's yep. go up and just see what everything looks like at night time. And you can see the beautiful, beautiful nighttime bridge. And then we ourselves be safe. Let's see. Can you hear any zombies inside? This has not been doing so well. Your monster spawner? My monster spawner, yeah. Oh. I think there was... Did a bad thing happen off camera, I think, when it blew up? It blew up? Yeah, a creeper was there. And even though it couldn't see me, it saw me and got excited and blew itself up. Oh. <laughs> and everything went a little bit nuts. I was oh. not happy, but I rebuilt it. But I'm just a little bit careful when I go there now. So let's see. Anything up here? No, this is all well protected. Oh, look at that bridge. Wow. That's awesome. <laughs> that does look really nice, actually. Yeah. And I like that I put those andesite, the white blocks, all mm -hmm. along. And check out the reflection in the water. It definitely yeah, looks better cool. better in nighttime than in daytime. And all those Endermen, they can't see us anymore. <laughs> and nothing over here. No, we are pretty well protected on all sides. Yeah. But the thing is, when they spawn, if they spawn over there, they can just wander this way. This isn't dangerous to them. But it looks like I've got a few patches over there by the water that have not been fully proofed. So I hope you guys have enjoyed seeing this really stupidly long bridge <laughs> our very 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 slow jaunt on the little minecart going across the bridge <laughs> we had fun trading with villagers and then you know we got in a bit of a fight i'm <laughs> proud that i managed to stand up to an enemy we screamed <laughs> once um i hope you guys <laughs> didn't get too startled i know we've seen in comments sometimes you guys said oh we saw that creeper and i got i like screamed and my mum didn't know what i was doing i hope it's you scream for yourself not we scare you we don't want to scare you but yeah. maybe we do uh so anyway i hope you've enjoyed this let us know what you think in the comments below and if you haven't done so already feel free to subscribe because there's plenty more minecraft on the way thanks for watching <laughs>